so the accusation is uh, made by your wife, uh, wants me to stick to his timetable all the time. So I wonder if you could stand. Um, where is Kashmir? There. Yes, she is a bit slow. Isn't she? There. Yeah, now, yes, <laughs> Kashmir there. So, um, well, expand on this, Kashmir. What, what sort of timetable? When you're going out, when you're doing things, how, how does it work? As soon as I come back from work, I'm on his time. So, so in order to do what? For eating meals, for going out, for doing for whatever everything. else a husband for and wife everything. might do? I don't know. For everything. Everything. I just have to be with him. Yeah. And was he like this before you got married, or did he only reveal this uh, later on? Later on. Later on. <laughs> okay, all right. Uh, so you pleaded not guilty to this charge. Absolutely. I expect you're thinking, get on with it, get on with it. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Mr. Prosecutor, Mr. Maxwell, will you please uh, take this case and uh, do what you can? <clears throat> Kushno! <laughs> yes. It has been put before the court that you like things done in your time, is that right? No, it's not that. <laughs> is that the reason why on two occasions you've waited a long time to answer? <laughs> <laughs> Leaving weird pregnant pauses? No, it's, it's the other way. It's the other way? <laughs> Could you enlighten us on... The other way. <laughs> what would that entail? Your good lady wife has put before the uh, jury of the audience that you, in fact, when she comes back from work, you, she has to do what you want to do. Is that not true? No, that is true. Oh. <laughs> Uh, Kashmir, can I just ask something of you sure. as a bit of evidence? Have you heard?